for Leaky TV for October 14th, 2010. There's not many of them, but here's today's top stories. Warner Brothers has released a series of revised trailers for Deathly Hallows Part 1. There's nothing really different about these trailers except the PG-13 rating and the fact that they'll only be released in 2D theaters and IMAX. Hmm. Also, Warner Brothers released yet another character banner. This time it's Dobby! Aww, Dobby. I'm pretty glad that uh, they're including Dobby in these character banners and promoting the fact that Dobby will make his return in this film. Now for Today in Potter. Five years ago today, in 2005, Fandango.com and MovieTickets.com were among the first to start pre-sale for tickets to see Goblet of Fire. Do you guys remember when you saw Goblet of Fire? I was in my hometown um, seeing it with a small little group of my high school friends after I had just gotten back from the New York premiere. <sighs> Those were the days. Yet uh, Goblet of Fire was at the time and still remains to be my least favorite Harry Potter film. Trivia time! The answer to Alex's trivia question from yesterday, who is driving the flying car in Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets and the Weasleys come to rescue Harry? The answer is... Fred Weasley. And now I'm going to pass you all over to our trivia correspondent, Rhiannon Payne, for today's trivia question. So your trivia question today is, in Goblet of Fire, when Harry found Barty Crouch Sr. in the Forbidden Forest, who was he walking with? If you know the answer, you should leave it in the comments below this video. Ooh, that was a hard one, Rhiannon. Thank you. Sorry if this video is coming to you a little late. Um, it's my first time editing it on my own without John. He usually does all the fancy, like, stuff that you see around, I think it's over here, around the video. He usually does that. I promise this will not happen next time. Until next time, don't forget to come up in the comments and tell us what you think.